Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you what to do if the Windows 11 taskbar is empty. The first solution you should definitely try out is to make a change in the registry. To do this press the Ctrl plus Alt plus Delete combination on your keyboard and then select Task Manager. In here just click on the file option in the upper tabs and then click on Run New Task. Here type in CMD and then press on OK. Then in the command prompt window just paste the following command that I also put in the description below and press enter to run it. The PC should reboot after this command and after restarting the taskbar should be restored. Another great solution is to uninstall recent updates. To do this just press the windows button then type update and then select the check for updates option from the search results. In here click on the update history option and then in the next slide scroll down and click on uninstall update. Next, select the update that caused this problem and select Uninstall, then click on OK to confirm your choice. You can also roll back to an earlier build. To do that, just press the Windows button, then type Update and select the Check for Updates option from the search results. In here, click on the Update History option and then scroll down until you find and select the Recovery option. In the next window, click the Go Back button. In here, you can simply follow the on-screen instructions and proceed to roll back to an earlier build. You can also change time and date settings. To do that, press the Ctrl plus Alt plus Delete shortcut and select Task Manager. In here, just click on the File option in the upper tabs and select Run New Task. Then type Control Panel and press Enter or click on OK. In here, just choose the Clock and Region option and afterwards select the Set the Time and Date button. Then click on the Change Date and Time Setting button, then select a date in the future and click on OK. Now just switch to the Internet Time tab and click on the Change Settings button. Make sure in here that the Synchronize with an Internet Time Server option is turned off and then click on OK. And that's it. Plenty of options to consider. As usual, for more information and details, you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video, just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.